one so I thought I would bring a Tom Ford lipstick swatch for you guys. Now here are three that I've purchased recently and I haven't used them yet. I am so super excited but I wanted to wait out to use them until I swatched them for you so they were nice and brand new so I could show you. I will take off my lipstick that I have on at the moment and we'll get right into it. Now I don't have any powder but I'm just going to powder over the top just with leftover just so there's none of my previous colour sort of peeking through. So that way you'll see the true colours of these. So the three that I have are Pink Dusk, In the Buff and Blush Nude. I will zoom in. The first one we'll try will be Blush Nude. Now these are all very nudey colours because they're colours that I use the most. I would probably wear these with a darker eye look than what I have on at the moment so they may not go with my whole look so just keep that in mind but I haven't done a lip swatch video before so this one will be my first and it will be worth it. So these are the Tom Ford lipsticks. Now the packaging is stunning on these. They are just absolutely gorgeous and the white is just so so pretty. The first one is Blush Nude 13. Now this one is um, Lip Colour Rouge uh, Lèvres. Not sure if I've said that right but that is the colour. So I'll zoom in so you guys can get a bit more of an idea of the colour. Now this is like a more of a darkish brown nude and how adorable with the Tom Ford logo on the top of the lipstick. That is exactly why I didn't want to use these before I showed you guys because they're just so so beautiful. Okay so we'll get up close and personal. that is blush nude it's definitely not as nude as I thought it was going to be I was a bit worried that it was going to be like concealer nude but it definitely comes on the lips for me as like a really pretty very light very very light sort of coral tinge but definitely like a brown nude so it's it's definitely an everyday sort of nude lip color for me so creamy they are beautifully creamy so easy to apply sorry the natural lighting is starting to change on me here absolutely beautiful really creamy easy to apply and I really quite like that color so that one is blush nude taking that one off. Now the next one I'm going to apply is called In The Buff. Now this one is a lip colour sheer so this is more of like a sheer wash of colour on the lips so um, apparently these are just more of like a glossy sort of lip colour. So yep so 01 In The Buff and this one has a different sort of shape like a squarish sort of yeah lipstick tip and again you've got the TF on the top of it and it's definitely yeah it's coming up pretty true to color in the viewfinder it's definitely look it looks like a like a shimmery sort of a nudie brown but it's definitely a darker kind of nude
so again super super creamy this one actually to me doesn't come across as too sheer on the lips it definitely doesn't have the same amount of color as blush nude again super duper creamy it definitely has more of like a shimmery sort of texture or color to it but again a beautiful nude perfect for every day it even this sort of color lip goes with this sort of um eye look something just very natural so because it is a sheer i think this would go with a lot of different eye looks really soft like buttery soft and the texture does remind me quite a bit like the YSL lip rouge for Lup days super creamy very buttery soft so love that I really quite like the color of this one it's very natural So that one is in the buff. Now lucky last we have here Pink Dusk. Now this is again one of just the regular lip colours and this is I think apparently one of their best sellers. I saw a little mark next to this when I was purchasing it online. Now this is more of like a pinky dusk nude. A little bit different to the others but again still a very nice nude but it's got more of a dusky, sort of dusty rose colour to it. This one is Pink Dusk, so again, so, so creamy. I really quite like this colour. I don't think I have anything quite like this, even in my MAC collection. So creamy. So you can see, it definitely is like a dark nude, sort of like a brownie nude, but it definitely has that really pretty, sort of dusky, rosy pink to it. So that one is Pink Dusk. That was all three of the Tom Ford lip swatches that I have. I hope I was able to do the colours justice in the daylight. It sort of goes in and out and it gets a bit hard to try and get the, you know, sort of proper colours of them. But at the moment I still have Pink Dusk on. I really like it. It's just a really easy sort of nude color to wear but I really did enjoy all three of these and I am a nude lip color girl so these will get tons of use now that I have swatched them all for you guys thanks very much for watching if you've got any questions please let me know thanks for watching I hope you enjoyed and thanks for joining me for my very first lip swatch video I hope I did okay I apply lipstick really badly so I apologize for that Thanks very much for watching and I'll see you guys soon. Bye.